Peter O'Reilly's various jobs took him on long journeys throughout the province. He spent many weeks and months away from Point Ellis House. The study was where Peter occupied much of his time while at home, where he would write letters, read, draft reports, and conduct business. From the study's desk, floor-to-ceiling windows provide scenic views over the Selkirk Water and the Gorge Waterway. The study is located in the oldest part of the house, constructed in 1862. Before changes made in the 1960s, the study had three doors. The first, a main entrance to the study from the hall. The second, an entrance to a luggage or box room. And the third, which no longer exists, a doorway between bedroom and study. This door allowed occupants to pass between the two rooms without disturbing the rest of the house. During his long career with the colonial and provincial governments, a great amount of paperwork passed over Peter's desk. This desk, once owned by his brother-in-law, Joseph Trutch, is filled with numerous drawers to store wax, blotting paper, seals, and various pieces of stationery. Today, visitors to the study can learn about Peter's work as an Indian Reserve Commissioner and see many artifacts on display that illuminate the comfort, luxury, and quality of living this work afforded the O'Reilly family.